boys and girls. Today we're learning some more things about the fruit of the spirit and we're learning about kindness. Kindness is a fruit of the spirit. And the more we have Jesus in our heart and in our lives, the more kindness we grow in ourselves and it becomes one of the fruits that we have inside of us. And when you're kind, it means you'll help somebody even if they don't help you and even if they're not nice to you or even if they're a beautiful person you just want to help them because you're being kind and I've got some things here this is my kindness chain here board and that means what we're doing today is we need a stapler with staples in it we need a good bright texture and we need some strips of paper. Now I've used some scraps. As long as you've got a plain side. And then what we're going to do is we're going to use these pieces of paper. And we're going to get our texter. And we're going to write down something kind somebody did for us. Or something kind that we've done for someone else. And the other day, I'll just write this while I talk to you. The other day I was at the shops and a lady needed some help to lift some heavy shopping in her trolley. So I said to her, would you like me to help you? And she said that would be good. So I did, I helped to lift some groceries into her trolley. So that was a kind thing that I could do for her because she couldn't do that herself. So I'm gonna make that the first chain in our kindness chain. Just like that, all right? So that's a chain, that's the first one. Okay, we're gonna see how long we can get this thing. And then something else happened. When I was at that shop and that lady did that for me, she needed help, which was a good thing to be able to help her with. She did something very nice for me. That lady, she gave me her wishies from her big shopping. So, I'm going to write that on this chain, wishies. So that means that I helped her and she helped me. And so that was a really kind thing. And I was very pleased that she did something nice for me as well. But that's not why I helped her because I didn't even know about those or she's until she did that. So that was an extra special surprise. Now I'm gonna get this chain, this piece of paper, I'm gonna put it in there. Now I know you know how to make paper chains, all right? And that's gonna be our number two paper chain. Now I've just stapled that, so we're gonna, we're gonna get... And then something else happened during this week. I had a very sad friend. So I just, we decided that maybe we could go for a walk with our dogs together. And that was good because I was able to cheer her up. And so that was really good to show her that kindness and cheer up a friend was good. So. They're all really good kindness things and I know that you girls and boys know about kindness and how important it is to be kind to other people. So I want you to start really thinking about being kind and how other people are kind to you. Now I'm just gonna leave this chain up here just in case anybody else decides that they wanna make that chain a bit longer. And I'll see you later, boys and girls. Hi, boys and girls. Wow, I wonder what's going on here. Wow. Kindness chain here. Wow, that's a great idea, isn't it? Maybe I can add some more to this chain to make it longer and see how long we can get this chain. You know, I, I, this week I vis visited a friend, a sick friend, who came out of hospital. She was very sick and she was lonely. She was on her own and she needed some company. 
So I went over and visited her to cheer her up. So, so I visited her. So we'll put that down. I visit a sick friend. Okay. So we might add that to the chain. How about that? So, put this on the chain, like that, boys and girls. And we can staple that on, like this. Okay, there we go. Right. Also, this week I shared on my father's day, father's day, I got some chocolate and some other people didn't have chocolate so I decided to share my chocolate with other people. So I'll put that down. I shared my chocolate. Okay. So we might put that on the chain. So Right. Wow, it's getting longer, isn't it, boys and girls? Look how much longer it can get when you start doing things for other people. It's all other people doing things for you and showing God's kindness to you. Or you showing the kindness to others. Wow. So, anyway, thank you. I'm going to have to head off and go and, um, yeah. See you boys and girls. Bye. Oh, look at this boys and girls. Someone's been over to our place and looked at it. Chain's getting bigger. Let's have a look. My goodness, what a big... Visiting a sick friend. Oh, wow, this looks really good. Now, I've got a couple of more of these right here. I'm thinking that this morning somebody made me breakfast. That's a kind thing. And I think I'll write that one down on here that someone made, I'm writing this out very quickly, me breakfast. I think that's a kind thing to do. Maybe you sometimes make breakfast for someone else. Now, here we go. It's getting longer. Maybe later on when we come back, or maybe even by next week, this whole chain will be growing because at the moment we've got one, two, three, four, five, Six. We've got six things on there right now. So I'm going to leave that there for a little while and see what happens. But I want you to think about kindness and how important it is. Because Jesus was kind. He was always kind to other people. And he helped people, even people that other people didn't like very much. And today's story is about Jesus healing some people that had an illness called leprosy. And that is a pretty um, bad disease to have because you get all these spots on you. And if someone touches your spots, they could get that. And when Jesus met these people, he wasn't worried about that one bit. He was full of kindness. Our story is going to be about that and I'm going to read you that story. It's from the Children's Bible. And once we've read that story, you might understand a little bit more about kindness. And you might also understand that when someone's kind to you, even if it's mum and dad making you breakfast, it's really important to say thank you. Anyway, I'll see you later, boys and girls. You have a good day. Bye-bye.